State softball, top-seeded Kakana taking on Burlington in a Division I semifinal. First inning, Burlington with the bases loaded, nobody out. Molly Barowitz pokes one through the left side, that brings home a run. But that's all Burlington got, just one run after the bases were loaded. Then in the third, Kakana's offense starts rolling. Anna LeCount to the left center gap, that's a two-run double to give the Ghosts their first lead. Next batter is Chloe Hankins. Rips one down the left field line. Another run scores. Three run frame for Kakana. All those coming with two outs. And that was just the start of it. The Ghosts scored three more in the fourth, four in the fifth, another in the sixth to win 11 to 1 on the 10 run rule. They're used to those kinds of offensive explosions, and they've got an interesting simile for them. You guys could hear the energy and you guys could hear the enthusiasm from the kids. Uh, you know, when they get on a roll like that, they're like piranhas on a zebra, man. It's, it's bad news. It's fun as a coach. I just kind of sit back and watch it go. It's like a machine that has got a lot of gas in it and you just kind of watch that machine roll. The piranha and zebra metaphor um, comes from when we were at least 10 years old and we just wanted to attack get that mentality as we were young and now use it here when we're older in bigger games and we're here in state not a hundred percent sure what that means but it's working they'll play for a state championship wednesday afternoon we'll be right back